right, we are so excited to have Jeff Pike here with us, of course, from Voodoo Chicken. Cool new place in downtown Johnson City. Got to go in and see you. Love the atmosphere. Love the menu. And in our studio kitchen right now, Jeff, it smells so good. Which sauce did you make? I made the uh, Nashville hot, uh, the Nashville medium hot sauce. So what we're going to do, we're going to take some of our tenders that we fry to order. And look at the tenders. Like, they're yeah, huge. They're... And you can tell the coating on them is really yummy. So we're going to drop that in there. Get some of this seasoning that we mixed up earlier all over that chicken. Just taking a bath in all that deliciousness. And then we'll put it oh. right there onto the bread. Now those tenders are huge. I buy the biggest I can find. <laughs> I had someone tell me, well, you sh what you should do is, is cut up breast and make your own tenders, but that's, that's, that's okay. not the same. No, you like to do it this way. Yes, and it takes yes. a while for people to decide what they want when they first come in. Do people like kind of stand at the menu? Stand at the menu boards. <laughs> We've got the video menu boards and they'll stand there. And of course they ask for recommendations. And I usually tell them that, the, that I've heard that the fried chicken's good. <laughs> I've heard. I've you heard. Try that. And you were telling me, I mean, you have lots of different options when it comes. So they kind of start there on the type of chicken that they want, right. the cut they want. So they either the bone in, we have breast, thighs, drumsticks, and wings. And the wings aren't little either. Yeah, they're, no, those are some good looking wings. And they're whole wings, so they've got everything there in one piece. Okay. Instead of being your, your typical bar wing that's, that's cut into flats and drums, these are the whole wing the whole wing so you can do it how you'd like and you know you encourage people to get a little messy it's going to take yeah. a couple napkins you just got to dig in on something like we this we got the paper towels on the tables and um so yeah you got to get messy you got to get into it yeah you really do once you pick your chicken that's half the battle then you got to pick your sauce and this is where it gets tricky because you have so many different sauces to choose from we have seven right now I believe yeah. eight we have cheer wine barbecue we have Korean sweet chili Korean soy garlic we have our four Nashville hots we have a habanero honey that one sounds really good um, habanero honey I did have a honey butter but it, it made me mad so I stopped making it and I love how you said and some of these I'm still working on you know yeah, you're always trying you just came up with a new sauce over here that the everybody's voodoo, loving the voodoo sauce which is a uh, it's kind of a kicked up remoulade or a uh, kicked up uh, comeback sauce okay uh, I had someone try it and said oh that's really good it reminds me of a uh, blooming onion sauce it does yes I yep mm -hmm. and then over there like the chicken is not enough you've got this banana pudding in the front <gasps> so you're doing different desserts Yes, I'm starting out with the banana pudding. I, I did a uh, peach cobbler yesterday. Uh -huh. It's peach cobbler. It's you weren't impressed? I is wasn't what impressed, I'm hearing from yes. you? Okay. <laughs> you I know, always that's put my I little like, twist mm. on things. And but this one. This, this, this is, is yes, this is my best effort at, at banana pudding. It's got a, a layer of vanilla wafers, a layer of pudding that's got vanilla and rum in it oh and it's got goodness. a layer of um of um bananas maybe? bananas okay. yeah okay bananas foster bananas oh goodness then another layer of pudding then vanilla wafers that have been baked in uh, -huh. uh with brown sugar butter and cinnamon oh well now i so know a why crisp you crisp on top I can't wait to try that. And hey, you need to go buy Voodoo Chicken today because it's National Fried Chicken Day. Who knew? Woo! Okay, we're gonna give everybody the information. It's super cute. It is right down there in downtown Johnson City, right across from um, the park right there. You can check them out on Facebook for more information and try some of the different sauces. Enjoy your fried chicken day. Jeff, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you. Time to eat. All right, coming up tomorrow, we continue downtown Johnson City Restaurant Week with a visit.
to the Olive, brand new in downtown Johnson City. Already have two other locations, but today, tomorrow, we're going to be talking about their newest one to open in downtown.